Hey guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you my review of the Caronique Hair Regrowth System. This product was sent to me for free in exchange for my honest review and I have been using it for about a month now. So I'm super excited to share with you what I think of it. If you're new to this channel, I am a stay-at-home mama to six little ones. We homeschool, we like to travel when we can. Um, I've only had this YouTube channel for a couple of months now, but I do have a blog and an Instagram that I use all the time, so I can link to those below. And of course, feel free to subscribe to this channel to keep up with this here. So as for the product, um, Kiranee Care Regrowth System comes in this box. And it comes with four separate products and I'll go through each of those individually and then I will share what I think of them. So the step one in this product, this is how they come. Step one is the scalp stimulating shampoo and the volumizing keratin conditioner. These are both sulfate free and they're designed to strengthen the hair at the scalp itself and throughout the actual hair follicles. Step two in this kit is the actual hair regrowth treatment. So the hair regrowth treatment is meant to be applied directly to the scalp, not throughout the hair. Um, I did notice when I was reading the labels on all of these before using though that it has a list of reasons not to use this product. And these reasons are if you have no family history of hair loss, if your hair loss is sudden or patchy, if your hair loss is associated with childbirth, if you do not know the reason for your hair loss, if you are under 18 years of age, and then there are other reasons too. Um, I thought this was pretty interesting because when I signed up for accepting this product, um, or when I accepted the product, it um, specifically said that this system was good for hair loss as a result of pregnancy and postpartum issues, and so I thought it would be perfect for me. Um, and it didn't say anything about being careful not to use this product. However, since it has that warning on here, I did not, I chose not to use this product. So just keep that in mind when I am giving my review and I'm in it here, that I am not referring to this one. I'm only referring to the shampoos and the final step. So then the final step in this system is the Karanique Lift and Repair Treatment Spray. So this you are to apply at the root and then kind of work it through your hair. This product is designed to strengthen and repair your hair. Um, this is kind of, this kind of deals with hair loss that's due to breakage. So it gives extra strength and it seals your hair and seals the split ends so that the hair that you do grow doesn't break off. That's the goal for this one. So now that you have a pretty good idea of what is in this kit, I'll just put it back together here, um, I thought I would share what I actually think of it. So when Karenique sent out this system for us to try, uh, they actually requested that we use it for 30 days before giving our review. And I'm actually really glad that they asked us to do that because, um, when I first tried it, I actually was not a fan. I got really nervous and I thought, oh no, this is terrible. How am I gonna review this? I don't like it. Um, but how I thought of it from when I first tried it over the course of the month when I gave it a chance actually changed quite a bit. So the first time I used it, um, they come in bottles about this size and I'm used to buying, you know, big, inexpensive bottles of shampoo. So I was nervous about using too much of it. It is thinner, um, like the consistency of the shampoo and conditioner seemed more watery, thinner than the current shampoo I had been using. And so I was just afraid to use too much. And so I only used a little bit. I didn't get a good lather with the shampoo. I didn't really feel like I got the conditioner in very well. And so when I was done showering, I just felt like my hair wasn't super clean. Um, then I of course skipped step two and went straight to the spray and when I put that on I just kind of sprayed it all over, um, you know, just let it sit on my hair and went to bed with wet hair. When I woke up, um, it kind of felt like I hadn't washed my hair at all. It was just kind of had a weird texture to it 
it didn't feel light and bouncy, I just didn't like it. So at this point I was pretty nervous. I also wasn't a big fan of how the spray smelled. Um, and so there was just nothing, <laughs> I was just really nervous about how I was gonna share it. But I thought, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna use it for the 30 days. Um, maybe the shampoo didn't work well because I didn't use enough or maybe it's my hair adjusting to a new product. I don't know, but I'm, I'll just give it the 30 days and see what I think. So the next several times I used it, I tried to be more intentional with actually using appropriate amounts and following the directions. So I went ahead and used as much of the shampoo and conditioner as I thought my hair needed, which is more than I would tend to use in other products. But when I did that, I did get a good lather with my hair. It felt much cleaner when I was rinsing it. The conditioner actually did feel like it was softening and detangling. So it must just be the type of product that takes a different amount from other brands. So that might be something to aware of that it does take a little bit more, but when I used it that way, um, it, I could definitely tell a difference. And then with the spray, if you read the instructions on it and don't just spray it all over like a crazy person, it does say to apply it directly to your roots and then work it through with your hands, not just kind of put it everywhere. And so I was very careful about putting just a little bit in my hair and then working it through. And I had a lot better results with that. I didn't notice the smell quite as much because it wasn't everywhere. Still not my favorite, but not nearly as noticeable. Um, and then after a few weeks of doing it that way, um, I can definitely tell a difference in my hair. It is softer. Um, it does feel stronger. I don't know if that's a psychological thing because I think it's supposed to be feeling stronger, but I do feel like I've had less breakage. Like when I brush my hair, you know, when I run my fingers through it, I'm not getting as much. I definitely do feel like I have less hair loss through just like, again, brushing or waking up. I feel like it is staying better. And for the record, I do have quite a bit of product left even after the 30 days. So I think that maybe just whatever product I'm used to, I'm just used to being able to only use a little bit and get away with it. But even still, using what I consider to be a lot, um, there's a lot left. So it's probably just my perception of how much there is based on maybe the consistency of it. So I wouldn't be afraid that it's not going to last very long. So for a little bit of background on me, I feel like my hair thinning out, like I mentioned before, um, stemmed from pregnancy, childbirth. You know, I've been having kids over the past eight years, five of them biologically. Um, so I've been either pregnant or breastfeeding for quite some time. It's only been a couple of months since I finished up breastfeeding the twins. So hormonally, my hair has been through a lot. Um, and so for the products that I use, which is the shampoo, the conditioner, the lift and repair treatment, those three are designed to um, kind of strengthen, heal, and repair. They're not focused on the regrowth. The only product that is focused on actually regrowing your hair is the one I did not use. And that's this one that is applied to the scalp. Um, I did do some research on it though because I wanted to be able to share with you what I thought of it since that is kind of a big part of their system. And from what I have researched, the ingredient that they use for the hair regrowth is FDA approved and it is clinically shown to help regrow hair. So you can be confident that not only will this product help regrow your hair, but the other products I do fully believe help strengthen it as well. One thing I noticed to be aware of though is with this hair regrowth treatment, um, if you have a diagnosed problem for the reason you're losing your hair and you stop using this treatment, then your hair loss will resume. So this will not be a you use it one time or for a couple months and then your hair is cured. It would have to be a continued use for as long as you want to have those results. So that's just something to be aware of, I feel like. Um, for someone like me, I feel like the products I used were a great boost to my hair. I started off with really thick hair before I have kids. Um, 
and so now I would consider it medium thickness it's not I wouldn't consider myself to have thin hair but compared to how thick it was before it's definitely less so for a product that just strengthens and repairs and prevents breakage that is perfect for me um, for someone who actually does have the hair that's quite a bit thinner and that might need some of that regrowth um, a longer use I could see how that would be appropriate for me, I don't think it's um, quite justified the price to continue spending that. Even though I do like how it has helped my hair, I just it's still thick enough that I probably won't keep spending the price to buy it again. I do recommend trying it out if you have thinner hair or hair loss and um, want to see a difference in your hair. Depending on your needs, it might be a really great product for you. Um, if you are looking for just hair strengthening like me and don't need quite as much as the regrowth, they do sell just shampoos separately so you wouldn't have to necessarily get the whole kit. Um, if you are interested in this kit, I'll show you the actual box again. It retails for $115 on their website. It is on sale for a little under $50 right now. Um, I will link to that below if you would like to do more research or read more reviews. I do not get anything if you choose to purchase. Um, I am just sharing it with you so that you can look more into it if you desire. I will also be posting um, a blog post about this review. I'm a person who likes to read through some things or go back sometimes without having to search for a video. So if you guys do end up trying this product or have tried this product or have had problems with thinning hair or hair loss, um, feel free to comment below, share your experience with me, let me know what you guys think of this. Um, I have enjoyed it so far and I'd love to hear what you think. So thanks for watching.